In today's video, I'm going to show you the best NVIDIA control panel settings you need to follow right now on your PC if you want to boost your FPS and get low input delay in Fortnite Chapter 5. Because in this video, we are going to follow some best settings for the NVIDIA and after that, we're also going to utilize the best GP optimization tools on our PC for boosting our overall GP performance in Fortnite. So guys, make sure to watch my this whole video and with wasting any time, let's dive straight into it. So guys, in the very first step, you need to open up GeForce Experience on your Windows. After that, go for this driver tab and there you will find out the latest driver update of the nvidia after the update of chapter 5 fortnite to so make sure to download the special update of nvidia on your pc so guys once you have downloaded and installed the latest driver of the nvidia on your pc now the next step before going on nvidia control panel settings i'm going to show you how you can disable the power throttling of your gpu on your windows so guys for that press windows out together from your keyboard and type here gpedit.msc and guys if you not find out this window by using this command so you can simply go into the search of your windows and search for local policy group and you will find out this local group editor now you need to go for computer configuration, go for administrative template. After that, go for the system tab and scroll down until you find power management. So open up this folder. Now you need to go for power throttling settings. Go for it and now you need to enable the setting for turning off the power throttling. So guys, simply go for this option. Enable the settings from here. After that, hit apply and click OK and close out the settings. So guys, now here in the very first step in the three settings, go for adjust image settings with the preview and set it on to the use the advanced 3D setting on your NVIDIA because we are going to customize the settings. Now you need to go for many 3D settings and there you will find that all the settings of your NVIDIA control panel. And now in the very first step here, you will find that image scaling. So I suggest you turn off the settings because this will help you to improve your FPS and performance. Now, ambition occlusion, turn off the settings, anti-stropic filtering, go for this option and set it on the off. Now, you need to go for anti anything FXAA, set it on to the off. After that, go for anti anything gamma correction and set it on to the on. Guys, make sure to turn off all the settings. After that, now you need to go for anti anything mode, set it on to the application control. Now, you need to go for anti anything transparency, turn it off. Background application max frame rate, set it on to the off. After that, here you will find that QDA GPU, guys, make sure it on your all because if you have multiple GPU installed on your PC, so then this option is helpful for you. Otherwise, simply guys, set it on the all. Now, here you will go to this DSR factor, and guys, this is the settings for enabling the virtual resolution on your pc on your monitor so therefore i suggest you to turn off the settings because this will help you a little bit for getting crispy image with better fps and performance after that guys here you will find that low latency mode you need to set it on the ultra for having the lower input layout of your mouse and keyboard now go for max frame rate set it on the off because we not want to limit our fps after that here you will find out monitor technology now it is compatible with your uh, monitor whatever you are using so i have g-sync compatible so turn it on next here we got multi-phrase sample set it on the off after that go for open gl rendering and open gl gdi set it on the auto and on your gpu after that here is important settings for your power management mode make sure to set it on the prefer maximum performance after that here you will find out prefer refresh rate Set it on the highest available according to your monitor. Now here you got this shadow cache size. So guys, go for this option and set it on to the 10GB because this will help you to saving the cache and help you to improving your overall PC performance. After that, now you need to go for texture filtering quality. Set it off. Texture filtering negative LOD bio. Set it on the allow. Texture filtering quality. Set it on the high performance. Texture filtering tree linear optimization. Turn it on. Thread optimization. Turn on the settings. Triple buffer, turn off the settings. Now here you got this vertical thing, turn it off. Now here you will go some VR settings, so guys simply set it on the default or simply follow the same exact settings which I'm using right now. After that, click on the apply button and apply all the settings in your NVIDIA control panel. Now let's go for the next step and open up this configure surrounded physics X. Go for this option and now here go for the physics settings. So simply click on the drop down and select out here your GPU. After that, now in the next step, you need to go for adjust desktop size and position. And guys, by using this settings, you can fix the black bar and you can use this stretch resolution in Fortnite. So guys, make sure to set this option on the full screen. After that, go for performance scaling, set it on your display. Once you have followed the settings, now you need to go for display settings under there you will find out this change resolution option so go for it and now you need to select out here the highest refresh rate of your monitor so guys for that go for pc now select out here your resolution whatever you're using go for refresh rate and set it on the highest refresh rate of your monitor after that hit apply and save the settings on your pc so guys now here in the next step you need to download throttle stop on your pc you can download it from my discord server and also from my website now once you download this pack you need to extract it and you will find out this folder Open up this folder, inside here you will find that it's exe file, so make sure to run this as administrator for having the full access. So guys, now here in the throttle stop, you need to first of all adjust the best power plan settings of your windows. So guys, here you will find out this power settings like performance, 
then game, then internet and then here you will go to some battery mode for saving the power of your laptop. But guys we are gamers so we need the best gaming performance so set this option onto the game. After that go for and check mark onto the high performance. After doing the settings in the throttle stop now simply turn on this option, hit on the save button and guys simply close out it and this application will keep running in your background whenever you turn on your PC and help you to optimizing your GP performance. So guys I hope so you love this video please make sure to drop a like on this video, subscribe to my channel and till the next video peace out.